Thank you. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Claire Fendi. If you guys are new here, welcome. Today I'm gonna to be show you guys, I'm gonna show you guys my Amazon find. So this is their clip-ins. Um, so this is literally straight out the pack, literally. So I bought one pack of 16 inch. Everything will be linked down below. You guys, this hair is super bomb. It literally looks like my real hair. Like, you cannot tell me this is not my real hair, like, at all. Because it looks so good. I want to end up doing... I, I low-key kind of want to do a bob so it could be, like, super full. I think that would be super cute. But I'm just scared to cut my own hair, so I just install it naturally. Um, so yeah, if you guys want to see how I put these in, this video is super quick, super short. Keep on watching. All the links will be linked down below. Of course, I'm going to make a little small commission from it every time you guys order. So make sure you guys order because this hair is bomb. Like, this is not sponsored, by the way. Like, it's not sponsored. I was supposed to do a sponsored video with this company, but they ended up, like, I don't like when the companies try to lower down my price because I know what I'm worth. And yeah so keep on watching to see how i install this and i'll see you guys later <laughs> i need to get my nose on but okay so hey guys today as you guys can see i have my natural hair out because we're going to be doing some clippings um i took them out the pack but I only got one bundle, y'all, and I feel like I should have got two. But we're going to work with what we have and just hope for the best. But I got these from Amazon, as you guys can tell by the title. Um, I don't know if I should dye it. I'm going to do this look again, but I just wanted to show you guys how I'm going to install it. If you guys are not new here, you guys know that my hair is naturally thin so i blow dry my hair and i'm just going to flat iron it when i flat iron it it's going to look much thinner than what it already is so i'm going to try to flat iron everything but my roots and yeah so let me just get my hair started for this style i've been wearing my natural hair you guys for almost a month now and I just been loving it. I'm gonna pin my hair up and start the flat iron process. And you guys can just watch, like, it's pretty self explanatory. I don't know if I should just come back and show you guys afterwards, but I'm gonna show you guys the first one. I'm just not gonna start at the root, I'm gonna start right here, like, towards the middle. So I'm going to take my fire iron. I'm just going to start right here towards the middle. Just going to just go. It looks so good already. And I'm just going to do everything. I actually need a trim, you guys. But I'm getting braids really soon. So I don't want to. You see how thin my hair is, you guys? So I'm just not going to do the roots. I'm going to just flat iron the rest of the hair and when I get to the top, I'll be right back. hair is done you guys no matter how much I cut my hair it always go back in layers I'm starting to think that's just how my hair is but look how thin my hair is y'all like, this is the length so the way that the bundles came well the clippings came they got two of each so these are two two of the long ones right here um, I'm thinking about like cutting the ends to make it like more sharper, but I might not be able to do that myself. So I'm gonna just measure. So this will go back here. Um, I'm actually excited. I haven't worn, I had tapings in a while ago, but I haven't had um, clippings. And now, like, I'm just over wigs, you guys. Like, I'm just so over wigs. 
um just the maintenance like i just only thing i don't like about wearing my real hair out is like the humidity and the fact that it's thin but i feel like with this um with these clippings i can manage it So I'm going to measure this to see if it fits behind my head and it does. So I'm just going to take it and I'm just going to open all of them. Now I do kind of feel like this part could be a little down. I'm just going to take it and I'm just going to brush some of the hair back so I just give it some more volume. Okay. Now I'm just going to take some leaf out to cover it. Take the other row and I'm just going to put it above where I put the other one. Look how flat. You can't even tell that I have like literally tracks underneath. Like it looks so flat. So I'm going to take the medium ones. So these, it comes in two, of course. my clipping I'm gonna do more on the corner because this is where like I want to like focus more on but I'm not gonna go like where my edges are at I'm just gonna go like right here if that makes sense the hair is a little thinner on this side so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my comb and I'm just gonna like brush tease it so it can be manageable The trick to keep it like locked in is if you go down, you go back up and you push it back down. And it's gonna look like this. It only went halfway, which is fine because I have another one. I'm gonna take one of the small ones and I'm just going to pin it in the back. And these are other small clips that I'm just going to put on the side. But honestly, I think I'm gonna make my part a little bit closer. Like right here. So I want it to cover as much as possible. So I'm going to take my last small clip and I'm just going to put it on the side. The hair is a little bit more silkier right here so I'm just going to go pull it apart so I can like tease it. Then I'm going to just do my part. So this is what it's looking like. I am in love with this hair. I love it so much. It looks so natural. I could literally do like a ponytail with it. It's so versatile. Guys, so this is what the hair is giving. It looks so so good like look at this you cannot tell me this is not my real hair the blend is perfect um i love the color my hair i dyed it blue black but this hair is like a i think this was, would be like a 1b or yeah because you can still kind of see like a little bit of brown but it doesn't you don't see like the contrast between the two colors i got this in 16 inches it's very true to length and this is just one pack, y'all. Like, if you guys got thicker hair, 
I do suggest that you get more packs because your hair is like so full. But since my hair was thin, I was only able to use one pack. And I took a risk with that. I was thinking about buying more, but I'm so happy that I only stuck with one. Um, but yeah guys, so this is the hair. I like it so much because it's so versatile. You could literally pin it up. You can do a ponytail with it, a half up, half down. It's super cute, super convenient. I think this is gonna be like my go-to, especially for the spring where like it's not super humid outside. So this will be perfect, 10 out of 10. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do my makeup and I'm gonna take pictures for the thumbnail so you guys can see. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.